is one of the largest killers of children throughout Africa. This is a treatable disease, it's a preventable disease, and yet families are struggling under the burden of this disease, countries are struggling under the burden of this disease. Asita Mahamuda is the mother of three children, nine, four, and two. She told us about her firstborn child, a boy who died. We visited a clinic to try and get treatment, but he didn't get any better. When I lost this child, I was heartbroken. I couldn't get rid of the pain. Still today, I have pain about my child. Soweba Abu also lost her firstborn, a daughter, to malaria at 18 months of age. Her second child, a son, died from malaria the next year. I have a new child and new joy now, but, of course, I'm afraid that this baby will be taken in the same way. But the future for these families is now more secure than it ever was. To combat malaria, UNICEF has rolled out an unprecedented campaign in Ghana distributing over two million treated bed nets to families with young children. Asita and Soweba and their children were invited to come to a health distribution center where they received a basket of life-saving services, immunizations against measles, polio vaccines, and insecticide-treated bed nets that cost UNICEF less than $6 each to provide. These bed nets will mean more healthy children in Ghana, and that means more energetic, productive kids ready for school and childhood, and happy, relieved mothers whose family budgets can now have money left over for important things, like their children's education. I hope that mothers in every community get the same help as I did, because in many ways it reduced my burden and brought some joy back into my life. Yeah. <laughs>